Hey folks, I'm Warren Lee Thomas, owner, owner of Beaufort Motorsports. That right there is a picture of MRP Speed Emblem on an exhaust system for a CF Moto. I just want to give you a little bit of background. I build trikes, I build bikes, I do racing, I do road, truck climbing, rock climbing, uh, mud hopping. I do it on a very professional level. Let me give you an idea and then I'll get back to the reason for this video. But that's MRP Speed's one, just one of their products for the CF Moto uh, that I put into my bikes. So bear with me. Alright. Right there, never said I was a photographer, folks. Right there is my Winston Cup car. <clears throat> She'll run 173 mile an hour all day long. Uh, this is not an advertisement. I'm just showing you this to know, so you would know uh, that I know speed and I know performance. Alright, enough of that. Now we're going to walk back in here and I'm going to show you another little project that I do. I race on a professional level, rock climbing and mud climbing. Alright, this is my little toy here. It says Buford Motorsports. Like I say, it's not an advertisement. Alright, this is a 700, 750 horse, just outright, just rock climbing, mud hopping son of a gun. Alright, now that we got enough of that, this is just to verify that uh, I know what I'm talking about. I'm very experienced since 1972. I have a PhD in mechanical engineering. <clears throat> now, on to the purpose of this video now. I'm going to show you my bikes. There's one of my trikes. This built from a CF Moto 250. Uh, that is a true differential, just like in your car, that is not a live axle. Everything has been put into this bike that you could possibly imagine. It's also fully automatic. Here's a shot of another one. It's blue. <coughs> now let me show you just the beginning of what happens here. All right. That name right there. Let's see if we can get a closer shot. You see that MRP? MRP <coughs> is what made this thing possible. I had a great bike, I had a great rear end, but it didn't have enough power to push it at safe speeds. All right? So, we developed this bike, and I was lacking a little bit of power. So I called Joe Martin at MRP. Now I want to show you some of what Joe Martin MRP provides me to put into my trikes so that I can take that bike from a 55, 60 mile an hour bike to a 92 mile an hour bike as a trike. And that's Dino Tune. Alright. Here's the selection. There's a coil in the lower right. There's the headers and exhaust. Let's see if we can get a little closer here. There we go. See the headers and exhaust by MRP speed right there various clamps and cables in the background to secure it exactly the way it's supposed to be. Anybody can put it on. Right here, we've got an MRP speed uh, high performance coil. Uh, that provides power to the unit. Okay. There's a, I believe this one's a 27 millimeter carburetor. It's a racing carburetor from MRP speed. There's a CDI box. It's a high performance CDI box which allows the coil to operate functionally and get uh, all the power you need to your ignition system and that's what it's got to have at high RPM and performance. This is a head. Now this is an exclusive deal. This is titanium valves and springs and the whole nine yards. <clears throat> I don't want to go into all the technical jargon, but this is a racing head built specifically for the 250 CF Moto, which is put into our high performance CF Moto bikes. Now to allow that to get to your bike or trike very fast, here we have the special roller weights that I put in them. I mix and match them according to my customer specifications once I find out what he wants to do to it or do with it. Now we take the MRP speed, and I don't know if you can see that that good or not, but it's an intake system to allow it to breathe for the bigger carburetor and the bigger exhaust. Then you tune it, and that way it flows real reasonable. Now after you get through all of that, don't forget that here we have the MRP battery. The MRP battery allows for higher capacity for the uh, uh, CDI box to charge to allow more power to the coil. It's a, it's a long, drawn-out effect, but it works very efficiently. Now, we also put in, which I don't have one here to show you, 
because uh, Joe, you got to send me some, which is the clutches and the variator assemblies that that we do on our bikes. So anyway, this is a video <clears throat> to show you what we do with the bikes. And this is, uh, like I say, the only people that have these parts are MRP Speed, and MRP Speed is is more than likely the only reason these bikes are the success they are today. I'm going to give you one more shot. Here we go. There's your headers, your exhaust, your brackets, your your uh, exhaust holders. Uh, there's the great emblem that made it all possible. Here's your coil, carburetor, CDI. There's the racing head. There's your roller weights that are various different weights. All you need to do is tell me or Joe Martin uh, where you actually are trying to do with the bike and we'll know where to put this the horsepower gain that you get and of course the intake and the battery. Uh, it's not a lot of parts that you're buying unnecessarily. These are parts that if you want an outright performing machine uh, then you have to get the MRP parts as they are the only one that's put through the effort to make them perform. Alright, last shot. There's the MRP exhaust system. That's all you can see on the bike because these are totally enclosed. But like I say, they're beautiful bikes. They perform very well. And that's pretty well the end of this film. There's a cherry red one. That's got every part that you just saw plus some in it. Uh, it has the variators. It, it has the, uh, the MRP Kevlar assisted belt. And it has the heavy duty clutch with the heavy clutch springs and the extended spring to allow it to stay in the lower gear longer. Uh, that's a real good feat for the uh, MRP, MRP speed accessories to, uh, to make this bike go at a red light just about as fast as anybody else. There you go. MRP speed, thank you for that blue one. MRP speed, thank you for that red one. Let's go to a work in progress. All MRP speed parts are going into this bike right here. It's all taken apart right now. Uh, you'll see what we actually do with the MRP speed parts. <coughs> we have the clutch assembly is gone, the barrier assembly is gone. There's the various parts all right there. Uh, we replace all this with MRP speed parts because they'll hold up to what we need them to hold up to. Let's walk around here. This is an MRP speed. This is where my rear end takes over. We have to replace the transmissions and all. This kit will not work on a standard bike. So we build the transmissions and the gear housings and everything else to keep up with the rear end and the torque that MRP speed has put back into the bike. It has to be able to handle that torque. And that pretty well concludes it. Give you a little shot at the bike up there. And my name is Lee Thomas, owner of Beaufort Motorsports. You can go to BeaufortMotorsports.com or you can call me at 843-271-6187. Or you can just simply call the boys over there at MRP Speed. They know who I am and I know who they are and you can look through and find out what you want. And I'll get it for you or install it for you or tell you what you need to get to make this thing run. All right. Y'all have a good day. Thank you.